guys a h s here this article right here from New York Post they want us to feel bad about the chick that has bad paperwork yeah they want us to feel bad about the chick that has bad paperwork they beat her ass in jail and they want us to feel bad about it they want us to feel bad about it ain't right no feel bad about R. Kelly if he get his ass whooped in jail or Harvey Weinstein if he get his ass whooped in jail for having bad paperwork but this article right here wants to feel bad about a chick with bad paperwork. Bad paperwork is bad paperwork. In male prison and female prison, you have bad paperwork. You have bad paperwork. You should have went to jail with an F on your paperwork. California mom accused of hosting wild teen sex parties attacked in jail. That's how it works in jail. When you have bad paperwork, you should have got an A on your paperwork, on your test. This is her ass right here. He wants to feel bad about this shit, man. I don't feel bad about this shit. A mom accused of hosting secret parties where she watched her teen son take advantage. Her teen son friend have sex was attacked by inmates at a, at a California jail. Yes. The five inmates who are being held at Santa Clara County Jail allegedly kicked the bitch, Santa O'Connor, and beat the shit out of her with their bare hands, according to court documents obtained by this news station. The five inmates. You think this shit happened to R. Kelly or Harvey Weinstein? They'll, they'll list all the inmates' names. <laughs> you think this shit happened? They're gonna say R. Kelly got his ass full, Harvey Weinstein got his ass full. They ain't gonna list out all the motherfucking names. Man. They want to feel so bad for their chick, man. I don't feel bad for her. I do not feel bad for her. Making those teen girls get sex sexually um, assaulted, man, by those boys, man. O'Connell has been locked up at Elmwood Correctional Facility since she was arrested for throwing booze filled teen sex parties. Jesus, man, she too old for this shit, man. Doing an eight months period in 2020. To 2021, eight months. They wants to feel bad for this bitch. She got her ass whooped in jail, without her husband' knowledge. Man, damn beta male. You don't know what his wife is into, man. You don't know what his wife is into, man. Oh, predator ass, man. Shannon O'Connor is accused of hosting wild parties and helping drunk teenage boy sexually assault girls in California. That's why she got her ass whooped in jail. She foster. That culture that made those teens get sexually assaulted. We do not support that shit on my channel. We do not support sexually assaulting anybody on my channel. We do not support that bullshit. Prosecutor said the party mom, man, man, they, they trying to make us seem like she's all of that. Met the then 14 and 15 year old teens through social media and through her son who attended Los Gatos High School. The girls told investigators that kind of watched as they were sexually assaulted by the boys. And she didn't step in to stop it, man. She didn't step in to stop it, man. She up there eating popcorn while that shit's going on, man. You see why she got her ass whooped? You see why they beat her ass, man? She up there uh, watching this shit. Instead of being like a good, a good, a good mother, and bringing that shit up and calling the authority to get those motherfuckers locked up, man. She up there watching that shit, eating popcorn, encouraging that shit, man. This shit is just ridiculous, ridiculous, man. The girls will vomit, be unable to stand, and fall unconscious. Prosecutor say, "Yeah, that's what you gotta ask." Well, the party mom, Shannon O'Connell, he tried to um, sensationalize that shit. Talking about the party mom, was attacked by five inmates at Enwood Correctional Facility. Doing one party, O'Connor allegedly handed a boy a condom. That was she got her ass whoop, and pushed him into a room where an intoxicated 14-year-old girl was lying on the bed. That was she got her ass whoop. The girl was afraid, ran and locked herself in the bathroom. Prosecutor said, "This shit is ridiculous, man. I don't feel sorry. That's got her ass whoop, not one bit." O'Connor, who has been awaiting trial, was attacked. By the five inmates, they put work in for about 16 seconds before deputies broke out the fight. The deputies were eating popcorn, man. Why she get a ass whoop? Deputies were eating popcorn, man. The same way how she was eating popcorn 
with other girl again assaulted, definitely were doing the same shit, man. They had to step in before 17 seconds, man. They had to step in before 17 seconds, man. They, they could lose their job. And they would they would have said 17 seconds to step in. The alleged party mom did not fight back. Cause she don't know how to fight. She don't know how to fight. Terrell wrote in court document. She was treated at the hospital for injury. She ain't had no damn injuries, man. Her alleged attackers are scheduled to appear in court on Tuesday to face charges. Nah, they say face no charges, man. We call that street justice. Meanwhile, Connell is facing 39 counts, including felony child endangerment and sexual battery, bad paperwork. O'Connell, who has worked as an administrative assistant at Aruba Network, also faces fraud charges. So she also stealing money for more than 100K in unauthorized charges on a company credit card. Yeah, her company, they gonna be the ass too, man. She gonna get her ass whooped again by Aruba Network. This is just ridiculous, man. They want us to feel bad. They trying to um, sensationalize her talking about the party mom. She's a bad person, man. And bad people, they get fucked up in jail. That's how the system works. If you're a bad person, even the criminals, they bad person, but they say you're better than us. And we have to fuck your ass up. And she got her ass fucked up in jail, man. Allowing those girls to be assaulted while she cheered that shit on, man. So, folks, like the video, give me your opinion.